Hello everyone, today we want to talk about drop D tuning, drop D guitar tuning. This is a wonderful alternate tuning that you can use on the acoustic guitar and it works great on, on the acoustic guitar, on the electric guitar as well. But let's say if you play folk music, if you play country or bluegrass or blues, this is something you want to you wanna know. So first of all, we need to tune down the last string to D. So we can go like this, we play the open D string. We can try to match the two sounds. I like to double check using the harmonic at the 12th fret of the D string. And then I play the harmonic at the 5th fret. Okay, like that. All right. And now we have a nice big D chord because we can play all six strings. I really love this sound. And uh, let me show you a couple of fingerings that I like to use. Uh, very simple ones. Uh, the first one is called, it's a G5, G power chord. And I'm just using, just using one finger. Uh, here the, the index is at the fifth fret, six numbers, six, five, and four. And I only strike those three strings. So this is a G5 or G power chord. And of course, if we move that down to the third fret, that will be a Neth power chord. And we can combine those two chords with, with the D chord, for example. Something like that. Uh, of course, you can use your index, you can use your ring finger. It really doesn't matter. Uh, and now let me show you a couple of couple of riffs that you can play. The first one is uh, is a bluesy is a bluesy lick uh, riff, and it sounds like this. It's cool, it's a cool riff and it's pretty simple. We start off with a couple of basses, so you just need to strike one string maybe, the, the whole chord maybe, and right after that we play a hammer on on the fifth string at the third fret, middle finger, open D, F, Okay, hammer on on the fifth string, open D, F, and then I play a very quick pull off like this from three to zero. That's an upstroke. Back to the C note on the fifth string and open D. Pull off. C, D, all together, okay that's a triplet that's a little bit tricky, the timing there is a little bit tricky, so again, slowly, Right after that, the second part of the riff is a little bit simpler. We, we repeat the two basses, we repeat the hammer on, open D, and then we go to an A note on the third string, second fret, followed by an F note. 
open D. So again, bass, bass, hammer on, open D, A, F, open D. And maybe you want to bend that F note a little bit. Let's put it all together from the very, very top. And then you can play uh, something like this. I'm sliding from F to G. end of the third beat I play an F and go back to the to the riff And that's the first riff. Now I want to show you another riff. This is more in the in the country style or bluegrass style, flat picking, and it sounds like this. Okay, that's the slow version. Now up to speed. One, two, one, two. I like this one it's we, we just play a lot of D notes this is a unison right so we start off with a slide from 4 to 5 on the 5th string and then we play the 5th string again and then we play the open D string like 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and that's the first bar Very simple. Now the second bar, we play the unison one more time, then we go down to the third fret, open string, the second fret, open string, and open A. The second bar, first bar and second bar okay again okay and then the second part of the riff you start off the same way one and two and three and okay and then on the fourth beat you go this D and C okay open A and then we play the last string at the fifth fret and the last string at the third fret you bend that F note and then you play open D okay. in front of that you want to play one and two and three and together okay now let me play the riff one more time from the top first bar the 
faster one two one two three four all right and there you have it I hope you liked this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell. If you want to have more lessons uh, on flat picking guitar or acoustic guitar, bluegrass guitar, just go to my website robertodallavecchia.com. You can also join my instructional channel. Uh, it's called Flat Picking Experience. Again, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video. Ciao ciao!